Welcome to Inside Japan and our guide on how to noodle. First step is the easiest. You take off the plastic wrapping from around the noodles. This plastic is recyclable. For the next step, you need to pull back the lid, but don't pull back too far. Just far enough to take out the ingredients. You might want to tilt and wiggle the bowl to make sure that you pulled out all of the ingredient packets. Most instant yakisoba packages have step-by-step -step instructions. But the next step can be tricky if you don't know how to read Japanese. If there is a clear packet of dried vegetables, you can open it and put it with the noodles before you pour the hot water. In Japan, electric kettles are very common and are ideal for instant noodles. You should pour the hot water until the water reaches the line or the groove on the bowl. Pouring cold water onto the noodles and sticking it into the microwave is not a good idea. After you're done pouring, close the lid and pinch the tab to keep it closed. You can put the liquid packets on the lid to hold it down and make sure the ingredients are easy to pour. The next step is to peel off the small tab in the back and drain the water. You might want to make sure the lid is closed and turn everything slightly upside down. After removing the water, you take the lid off completely. This is where you pour out the other packets onto the noodles. If you pour everything in one area, it'll be harder to mix it later. The best thing to do is to spread everything out evenly. After you've poured out everything, you need to mix everything together with the noodles. For the best results, you may want to take your time and make sure everything is mixed evenly. Some of the noodles on the bottom might not be mixed well, so be sure not to forget the bottom noodles. After you're done mixing, you can enjoy your instant yakisoba. If you have any questions, comments, or thoughts, please leave them in the comments section down below. Or you can contact us on Twitter at InsideJapanInfo. Thank you for watching our video, and we hope you can join us again.